Hey there everyone out in YouTube land, this is Mac and welcome to Metal Lancer Gaming. Before we get start, before we start, please help a growing channel out by hitting that like button, subscribe, comment if you want, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss out on any content. Also, if you want to help out a bit more, please donate at PayPal. The link is in the description and every little bit helps. Thank you. Now, today we're going to do something a little different. How to get your ARC games to run without ARC. And yeah. Yeah, this is uh <laughs> this is definitely something different. So here we are, we got Neverwinter and Star Trek Online. Those are the two I've uh, installed using ARC. A little backstory here, uh well back in December I upgraded from eight point one to ten and worst mistake of my life I just didn't realize it at the time because a couple a couple weeks ago I had to uh, do kind of a nuke and pave you might say on uh, Windows 10 I had to download and and like fully upgraded to Windows 10 which sucked yeah that 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 was not fun that was not fun at all so anyhow today though you know I lost a lot of games you know a few games survived like Star Lancer and uh, a few others but most of them phew, had to go back on GOG and re-download them oh one of the fun things was um, one of the early games I bought off of Steam a bully a scholarship edition doesn't need steam anymore go figure but we'll get into that later um, I would not recommend doing it that way it's anyhow <laughs> all right we uh, this PC all right I'm gonna show y'all how to get your Star Trek online Neverwinter basically th this should work with any arc game out there any game that uses arc as a launcher right we go to Windows C program files x86 and scroll down You're gonna have Star Trek online underscore e in right here and gonna have Neverwinter underscore e in right there this is what you want to use right right here don't use you know the ones they send to your desktop after you install them because those don't work like this one right here I mean there, there's a few different variations of the Star Trek online logo yeah, this is the one they sent to my desktop right there you know what we're going to go ahead and get rid of that because this looks nothing like the one you should have the one you should have to run the game to run uh, Star Trek online is this one right here yeah, I'll go ahead and uh, send that to desktop create shortcut of course bring it down and as you can see it looks quite a bit different than the one they uh, they want you to use that will actually uh, bring up arc this one right here you don't need it to do anything except well I'm gonna rename it get rid of the shortcut part and boom good to go on that squared away Neverwinter. Neverwinter is a little trickier because when you go into Neverwinter, go up here in Neverwinter, the uh, the one you want to use that will bypass Arc looks exactly like the one that Arc wants you to use. So we're going to go ahead and send to desktop create shortcut and bring it down here and compare them side by side yep identical except this one says shortcut so what you gotta do with this one the one that doesn't say shortcut the one that they uh, throw at you just delete that and move that over do the rename get rid of the shortcut part and bing bang boom you're done now, now I'm gonna go ahead and uh, you know, empty my trash can. And I'm gonna do this right here. Watch this. 
See, arc should be coming up right now, but it isn't. And bam, all you got to do is input your password, log in, you're good to go. Not a big deal. Squared the F away, right there. Same thing with Neverwinter. No arc to deal with. Told you. Same deal. Put in your password and you're squared away. Done. Taken care of. Yeah, I uh, reinstalled arc in these two last night. And they're working perfectly without arc. I tested them both out a little while ago. And so, yeah, that's pretty much it. That's how to get to play your ARC games without ARC. I mean, I can go in right now and uh, totally... Uh, yeah, I can go in right now and totally uh, uninstall ARC. These will be just fine. No big deal. Of course, it would take forever to uninstall ARC, so I'm not going to do that just yet. Probably going to make like uh, one or two more videos today, hopefully. Time permitting and family commitments, you know, all all that. <laughs> but anyhow, um, hope you all found this uh, video informative. Help you out in case you don't like, uh, you know, third-party apps. I might be uh, doing one in the near future when it comes to Steam to see if I can get a, you know, Steam. Uh, you know, see if I can get a uh, Steam uh, Star Trek Online to play without Steam. You know that would that would be great, wouldn't it? I don't know if it'll work, but you never know. It might, it might not. But I'm still gonna give it a shot. So, anyhow, yeah. Um, so y'all take care of yourselves, take care of each other, be safe out there. And this is Max signing off.